Hey, what's up? It's Tone. So we're going to do the Ableton tutorial on how to name your return tracks. So this works the same way as naming your MIDI tracks and your audio tracks. So your return tracks are down here. So two ways to do it. So left click to highlight, then on Mac, hold the command button. And while holding the command button, press R. Then you can type in here. So let's just call this snare reverb. And then left click to get off of it. The other way to do it is left click to highlight, right click and then left click on rename. Then we can type in here and let's call this snare delay. Then return to get off of it. So one thing to keep in mind is that your return tracks, the audio signal is coming from either uh, a MIDI track or audio track or a combination of both. So just keep that in mind with the labeling so you know where your audio signal is coming from on each return track. 